summer dry Just looking for a paradise Your hand in mine, you and I You and I Hit the beach when we land Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube video. Today is Wednesday. That's what I'm like vlogging off the, or not vlogging, but like recording today because I'm going to be busy tomorrow because it's going to be Thanksgiving. This is going to be go up tomorrow. So I hope you have a wonderful Thanksgiving and yeah, hi. And make sure you like, subscribe, and turn on your post notifications. And today's video is going to be about, I'm going to show you all my collections. Okay, let's figure out where I can tell my phone. And sorry for the background of the talking. People outside are talking. Okay, I guess my phone can go right here. And then I'm like, okay, no, that's not gonna work. Cause it's a stupid cord. So I'm like, put the cord over there. I'll put that like, I'll work it like, oh my God, maybe, maybe that'll work. Maybe. I'll move my pillow there. Okay, so my first collections that I grabbed are books. So these are like collections of like from Amazon or like the story of, and I do not have all of the story of that they are, but I do have all the ones that I have gotten. And they're like $6, maybe five or $6, not that much. First one that I have from the pile is Neil Armstrong. And then it tells you like about it and then it has like some questions in to see if you paid attention. Second one is Barack Obama. The third one is the story, and then it'll be like the story of Martin Luther King, and then it'll say the name. And then the fourth one is George Washington. Now it's gonna be backwards for y'all. The fifth one is Alexander Hamilton, which this one was actually my first one. My cousin got me that for my birthday. And that's when I started it, cause I had it on my list, and then she got it for me. The sixth, I think. Um is Abraham Lincoln. Let me count it. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah. So the seventh one is Princess Diana. This is the new recent one that I've gotten. And then the eighth one is Helen Keller. And the, um, the ninth one is Jim Henson. So I have nine books of these. So like that's a collection of these. Put that right there. Or, well. <laughs> that's my name. Um, so, next is another collection of books. I survived books. There's a lot. Okay, I'm gonna start off with this one. I have not read this one, but, like, almost, like, I've read every single one of them else. I'll let you know if I've read them. And, yes, I have read all those other ones of these ones. Okay, the I Survived the Galveston Hurricane 1900. I have not read that. That is a new one. But I'm on a new book right now, so that's why. I would have done my Dork Diary series, but I only have one, two, like, seven and eight. I don't have all of them, so I'm on number two. So that's why I was like, I do have more series. Then I do that. I Survived the Great Molasses Flood, 1919. I have read that. I Survived the Japanese Tsunami, 2011. That was when my brother was born, and I have read that. I survived the Joplin uh, tornado 2011 when my brother was born. And yes, I have never read that. Um, I survived true stories, natural nature attacks, four terrifying tales of disaster and survival. And I have read that. Um, I survived the great Chicago fire 1871. And I'm, I've already read this, but I'm currently reading this to like somebody um, that I know. Um, I survived... The Eruption of Mount St. Helens, 1918. I have read that, and that was when my aunt, a couple of my aunts were born. I Survived Hurricane Katrina, 2005, and I have read that. Those were like, like when my parents got born. I Survived the California Wildfires, 2018, and I have read that. That's like the recent one, I believe. I Survived the Shark Attacks of 1916. I have read that. I Survived the Hindenburg Disaster, 1937. I have read that. That was like a couple years after my great grandma was born. I think she was born like 1933 or 1934. I survived the attacks of September 11, 2001, and I have read that. And my uncle was only a couple months old when that happened. I survived the children's blizzard, 1888, and I have read that. I survived the sinking of the Titanic, 1912, and I have read that. I sur I mean, I survived the attack of the Grizzlers. 
1967. I have read that. That was just a couple years after my grandfather was born. I survived the Navy invasion 1944 and I have read that and there are still a couple books that I don't have but I have most of them. I gotta figure out where to put this. I guess I'm putting that back there. That's like huge. Now I'm gonna go on with my sprays. I only have four of them but this one's from Bath and Body Works and it's a thousand wishes. This one's also from Bath and Body Works and it smells like rose. This one is, I don't know where this is from. It might just been like from Walmart or something because it doesn't say. But this is like mermaid vibes. It's like mermaid vibes. And then this one, I don't really know it's from. I just know one of my friends got it for me and it's like smells like cotton candy. So those are my sprays. Put that like right there. Now off to my hand sanitizers. I have like a couple more things. Okay. This one is Pumpkin Cupcake, and it's from Bath & Body Works. This one's Be a Nice Human, and it's from Bath & Body Works. This one's just like a regular hand sanitizer thing, like from Walmart. This, oh. This is a Pineapple Mango, and I'm assuming it's just like, I don't know where that's exactly from, because my mom just gave it to me. This one's from, it's like cucumber and melon, melon scent, scented. It's hand sanitizer. And that I believe is from like Walmart or something. So those are my hand sanitizers. Now off to my Shopkins. If you don't know what that is, I mean, you gotta be insane. Let me like fix these so I can put them back. Oh, that doesn't really fit. Mm, might take a little while okay well i'm just gonna pull out the ones that are like not in the thing and then i'll put them back of where they go but i used to like i still am obsessive with them kind of but not really i like now i just they're like collections and they're like a keepsake and stuff i don't really like obsess over them anymore like ask for them i'll put those to the side and then i'll show y'all but these are the ones that I have right now. And then there's more. I know I definitely have more, but I don't know where they are. I know I like have these. I honestly don't know where the others are. Cause I know there's like a lot of missing, like a lot that I can't find, but I don't know where they are. Um, and then here's like, um, this one's like, I guess like a cake. This one is like soda pop. This one's like, I guess like a raspberry. This one I'm assuming is like a hairbrush. This one is another birthday cake. This one's I'm assuming a wedding cake. I'm assuming a pretzel. Honestly, I don't know. This I know is a present. This one's like another cake. I have like so many cakes. I'm assuming this is like ramen or like spaghetti. Honestly, I don't know. This is like an apple. This one is a cake, like uh, eaten at a bite. And then, sorry for the background. And then here's like the other ones. If you can see them, I know. <laughs> Let me just put those in there. And then I have, it's like gift card or something. It's not really real. And it's like, sign your name here. I never did. And it's like a VIP Shopkin thing. Okay. So we're done with that. And then next, I have like three charms. This one's a turtle. Some pumpkin. It says Iowa. An arrow. A hummingbird. Snowflake. Big sis. Ladybug. Dog. Special niece. A l I love you. I can't think of what this is. A I think it starts with an F, but it's like a Boy Scout thing. And then like two hearts. And then on this one, it says Texas, an anchor, blue bonnet, panda. And it has a heart and it says granddaughter. And then a birthday cake says happy birthday. Then this other one says Colorado and Minnesota. And those are all of my collections. Like charms, Shopkins books, more books, 
sprays, hand sanitizers, and stuff. Um, so yeah, those are all my collections. Whoops. Those are all my collections that I have, and I hope you liked today video, today's video, and I hope you have a great Thanksgiving, and bye, and wait, before I go, um, oh shoot, what was I gonna say? Uh, before I go, I want you to comment down in the comments of what you're grateful for today. Bye, have a wonderful Thanksgiving.